What's going on YouTube? Today is November 25th, 2020. We are here in Tulsa, Oklahoma for the USA BMX Grand Nationals. Today is Wednesday. It's the practice day where we can all figure out the track before racing starts. Hopefully all my hard work and all the nationals I've raced this year pay off and I can come out of this race with a good national standing. And to add on to that, I just made a trial run of merch to see how it all goes. I'm going to be selling some next year in 2021 if you'd like to buy some, so make sure you stay tuned for that. practice is over I feel pretty good on the track I'm only having a little bit of trouble with the first jump but towards the end of practice my last couple laps I felt like I got it pretty good so I'm just gonna rest up get ready for the rest of the weekend and ride my best <laughs> Today is Friday, November 27th. I made it out first round yesterday for ROC. So today we're gonna finish up ROC and then we have the NAG5 challenge tonight where all the pros will be racing. So it's gonna be a long day, but I'm ready for it.
fun at the Grands. Seventeen to twenty year old expert main moto one sixteen and out of the middle coming on in to turn number oh that round they come. Look like Merlot ah. Merlot getting caught up in the traffic. Bramer takes a left-hand turn out of the corner, but the lead rider getting it done right now. Got to be more coming back at us on the three by Trenton Moore rocking it. Right now coming into the corner, bringing them back at us. Moore going to get on the win. Freer's going to get the second. Bramer's going to get the three. What's up, guys? With the Nav 5 Challenge practice behind Ethan Popovich. ROC. I got fifth place. Pretty good. I was the youngest one in the main event, so I'm pretty happy on where I finished. Now we're starting the NAG5 challenge. It's the night show, so hopefully it can go good. I can get in that main event and see how I finish. Avon, Indiana, Factory Hyper, 1720 Expert, Drew Polk. On your 67 bike, out of... Okay, riders, random start. Riders ready, watch the gate. Uh, let's heat it up right now as we head on downtown. Supercross, where are you guys at? Got to be Bramer on the top spot, getting things... Come. 
Bramer getting down and bringing it back down through that third straightaway. Bramer, Polk, one, two, got to be Popovich. Mudslinger sitting on the three spot. Oh, lost one right there as they come back around the 31 bike. Going to find a way in. Got to be Dustin Jacobs, factory mangler. <laughs> Lane number four on the 32 bike come out of Avon, Indiana for the hyper ride, Drew Polk. Yeah. All right, here we go. Okay, riders, let them start. Riders, ready, watch the gate. <laughs> spot. It is Cole and Pope running one and two. Cardwell wants it back. Yeah, let's go! Woo! Let's go! Challenge for the boys, big dollars on the line. Quick Nick Adams, Rockstar Rift Tangent getting things fired up right now. The Bird Man Crane on the two spot. Gotta be Cole sitting on the threes. They come on back down the line. But it's all Adams out front right now. USA Cycling Junior National Champion getting things done. Rockstar Rift Tangent. Adams coming back home. Gonna lock this one down. Adams, Crane, Cole, Bramer, Elizondo, Polk. So yesterday, as expected, it was a really long day. I ran something like 10 full laps, race laps, plus practice. So by the time I hit the main event, I was pretty tired, but 
I still got into the final. I got sixth, which gave me 150 bucks. So this is Saturday. It's gonna be first and second round. And hopefully I can make it out and then move on to Sunday. Grand 2020 is over. I'm back home. And as you probably just saw, I crashed in my quarter. I had a rider slide out right in front of me in the first turn, and I had nowhere to go. I didn't really have any control over the situation, but as many of you probably know, you can't always get your way in BMX, and it is what it is. Regardless of how things ended, I still got National Age Group or NAG 4 and National 39. And considering that I'm a 17 year old in the 17 to 20 expert class, it's still very good to be in that top five. So I'm happy with those results in that aspect. I was hoping for a top three nag, but obviously it didn't end that way. But I still have next year, so hopefully I can make next year even better. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.